Hey guys, Brenny here, and welcome to a Sky Ant Farm episode. I have gone and returned our third diamond, well, well no, third gem, and I actually killed uh, some chickens with it, hoping that it would loot, because it does have looting 2 on it, I believe, and fire aspect 1, so I was hoping I'd get more cooked chicken, but apparently I don't. Oh yeah, alright, great start to the episode, start raining. Alright, let's go and find cursed gems, there it is. And we can mark that off. I really feel like I can mark off the mine shaft, but I did stumble upon it again. I finished off the uh, the lowest level of our digging. I don't even know what you'd really call it. Like, method digging? <laughs> I, I, I feel like I'm just making up random names. But I've seen a lot of uh, cobblestone down here that I always seem to walk past. And now I'm actually having issues finding it. So I figured we would collect that up, and then we could go to the end of our pathway. Uh, any cobblestone? Why can I not see? I swear! There was like three veins of it that I wanted to get because I keep skipping over cobblestone. And you know, if I slowly just go around and collect all this stuff, like, it builds up to the point where I won't be so stingy with cobblestone. But apparently there is no cobblestone here. Let's, uh... Oh, there, there's some! Alright, let's get that one. Because apparently... Oh, and there's some more. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Um, so I was thinking... I really want to find this one source of water, as well as mark off some other challenges. So this episode, I might try to collect some iron while going down our pathways, because obviously uh, things are going to spawn, and then we'll find the iron that way. Let's go down... Probably not the smartest way to get down there, but oh, I thought I just broke a torch. That's how, like, the, the particle effects of me landing on it. Let's get rid of him, because... Oh! Oh, wow! Did mobs just spawn from a spawner somewhere here and then fall off? So that's pretty cool. Alright, let's uh, go up here, and we'll get this cobblestone. And then I'm going to go to the end of the map, which, uh, on... That pa no, that pathway, I believe, and then that will actually take us to the mine shaft again, which actually looked as if it had a lot more areas for us to search, and that's why I want to go back. I, I kind of want to fully search it and then be confident breaking the sign, because right now I'm like, eh, you know, I don't feel like I searched it enough to break the sign. There we go, got the cobble, now let's adventure. So, I went and chopped down some trees, smelt- oh, smelted cooked the logs into coal so we had some source of light because I plan on going to the mine shaft and yeah uh, oh shit oh well that went better than I would have liked to go well better than expected but we, I saw that cobblestone and I wanted to collect it but mr. XX no scope jump across like that was legit like a trick shot right there cuz he'd suicided just to try to kill me and that was very rude. Uh, but yeah, I found some cobblestone and I figured we would harvest it up because don't you dare. I hear another one and I just don't want it to happen. Let's grab this cobblestone here. You know what's really, uh, I, I thought the cobblestone veins would always be a tad bigger, but some of them are only like one or two blocks and it's a bit annoying to be honest. I'll, I'll grab them and I'll be like, oh, wow, well, wow, well, that, that wasn't worth the effort. But there we go, we have 17 more cobblestone, plus I think about 30 in our chest, so... If we lose these tools, at least we can make them again without feeling broke, but... I really do want to find the water source, because that will mean we can get unlimited cobblestone, I believe. Uh, there's gotta be lava on the map, if there's no I've heard lava on the map, there's lava on this map. Uh, in the blaze area, but I'm not actually- Oh! Should we go have a look-see? feel like we should go have a look-see and get some lava, because that is something we're gonna have to get any- Hello, creeper buddy. Wow, mobs seem to go to so much more effort now to kill you, but, you know, that's, I suppose, a good thing and a bad thing. Uh, oh, I've always wanted, like, mob improvements, you know? Like, if the zombies could jump occasionally, I wouldn't have an issue. Like, jump two blocks long or two blocks high. I think that would be fun, you know? It'd, re it'd really, really step up my hardcore. Like, I would be- at that point where I'm worried for my life in the game all the time, but there's our charcoal, as you can see. I figured 52 torches and some sticks was enough. Oh, another thing I want to collect is, uh, what is it? 
iron so we can make an anvil so we can do the make the knockback so actually we can just find the knockback sword and a punch bow i'm pretty sure but we do have a punch two booklet which we could put the well, booklet book <laughs> that we could put on the bow uh but let's go and make a bucket i probably should make two buckets just in case i ever do stumble upon the water source but i'm not in too much of a rush now nine eighteen twenty seven 28, 29, 30, 31 iron we need to make an anvil so that we can do the book thing. Uh, and then we also need some levels, which usually isn't too hard, but the fact that we are, like, always dying... Well, actually, we don't die too often. I just don't find myself alive long enough to build up some XP. I wonder if any of you remember, what's the highest level you've seen me at in this series so far? Because I've died off and on, you know, like... Most of the time I get my stuff back though, but it's just dying in a game sucks. Alright, so this one has fire over here is the drop down. So we're actually in the area now. Any lava in here though? There's got to be lava in here. It's, it's based on the nether. What? I've heard lava. Maybe it's this. What does this button do? It's annoying me that I it doesn't do anything. So what we want to do is walk around and listen, which is one of the funnest YouTube commentaries in the world. Oh, maybe there isn't uh, any, la Ooh. any lava here that I'm at least confident about. Wow, so maybe there's only one water source but no lava, so... The water source is kind of useless to us, at least cobblestone-wise. And... Oh, where that... Oh, no, I'm lost. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm all good. Alright, so I suppose I'll keep this bucket on me because I cannot be bothered taking it back up the stairs because they're annoying to climb up. What we're going to do now is go all the way in this direction and find the area where I left off mining. Okay, guys, so this is usually where we go down. And over there is where the ninja fortress is that... I'm taking a little break from, if you haven't noticed. I'm off doing other projects, or well, not projects, just... It's very stressful to be in there the whole time. I'm just like, please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. And occasionally I want a break from that because it stresses me out. So, we mined off in this direction, and I have got to the end of the map, and there is actually the mine shaft there, and I believe there's a spawner, but I'm not... Oh, I was gonna go kill him, but... He's not really worth it because he's not an iron mob and that's the one we want to kill. Um, yeah, so I believe there's a mineshaft and a spawner. We'll have a look see at the sp thought there was a mob there. We'll have- oh! Forgot I- I've been- I haven't been down here in a while. Like, I made it and then I farmed for ages. Like, ooh, cobble. I love cobble, as you guys know recently. It's my new, uh, little hobby to collect all the cobble because for so many- This whole series, I've just skipped over it and now I'm finally collecting it, which I'm sure a lot of you like. Alright, let's go down this way, light this area up, I hear a zombie, uh, can't see him, and down there's the spawner, which, as you can see, I don't know if it's looted, because you can't really see it very well, this zombie is intimidating me. That That's his plan. Oh, I forgot about this, oh crap, he's in the cave! This is a little cave that, uh, I believe there was two ways into, but I actually, uh, blocked off one of the ways because I, I went in there for a sec. Probably went in there to actually regain my health, but let's pillar down- what, is this pillory? I don't really know what you call this, to be honest. Let's st staircase down this wall and see what we've got down here, because I am extremely interested in conquering this mob spawner. But I don't know if we can get any lower than this, from this height, without going all the way over there, which seems like a lot of effort. If I could get a tad closer, I wouldn't actually mind dropping in from here, because what we could do is... But I cannot get closer. We could just put a block around us in the middle, wait for the skeleton get to us, drop down the middle again and break the spawners. This one does not look very hard at all, but this drop looks just over enough. Oh, I really want to try it, guys. Hmm... Is it worth it? Let's see what this skeleton does. It, if I drop down there, I'm going to be so weak that that skeleton will one-shot me. Like, 
I don't even know if I'll survive the drop. So what I'm going to do is pillar all the way, well not pillar, uh, mine, all the way over there uh, while placing blocks under me, like off in this direction. And then I'm going to use that wall to lower myself down and then we will go from there. Okay guys, so that's not a real spider, but I, I was mining across and bumped into the- Oh shit, now it is! <laughs> It must have just been glitched, but as you can see, there's some mineshaft there that we haven't searched, so that is good and bad news. Uh, this skeleton is scaring the crap out of me, but I can't get close to it because of these creepers. Alright, let's do this. Let's scooch in, go there, ease our way forward. There should be some chests in here since... Oh shit, oh shit, oh no, I don't like these little spiders at all. Let's break that, break that, break that, uh, keep ourselves safe. Give ourselves some health, light up the rest of this pathway, get seen by those skeletons. I really want to know what's in that chest so badly. Oh, a regenerate- Ooh! I don't know if I'll use that now, even though we are in the position where it would be good to use. Oh, oh, there we go. Alright, those priorities are pretty good, guys. Uh, no clue what's going on in this little hole, but I feel like there would be- Alright, so what we're going to do is break the, uh chest here. Oh, I found some more cobblestone if you didn't notice. Don't have a clue where that came from, but alright. Uh, let's get you. We're taking this quite slow, which is good. That's not slow. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> alright, there we go. I suppose I'll heal up in here. Uh, let's go and put that there. And I'm just gonna put the extra lighting in here because there's a spawner on the other side of this wall. If that spawner spawns a spider in here, we're dead. And health time. Okay guys, so we are all healthed up. Uh, just got our last half a heart there. Let's go and kick some butt. Uh, so spider there coming at us. Why did he? Wow, he really like, and looks as if there's a spider spawner there. So let's block. I don't have a clue what's going on with these skeletons, but. Oh, all right. So there was two. <laughs> Alright, let's go up here. I heard two shots, and I assume two skeletons. What? Why is it? Wow, this area is such a dangerous, like, battle. Oh, God. Oh, no! You shall not pass! Alright, let's break that. Put that there. Uh, put a torch here. Once again, not in a fun scenario, but... Scenario? Scenario. I have no clue how to say that word. That actually happens quite often me, to me. Is that bad? Like, probably once a week, I'm like, how do I say this word? Like, I just have no clue at all how to say a certain word. All right, let's, I know, super interesting, but, you know, figured I'd give you guys some info on me. Why is there so many in here? Let's take it slow. I assume that, oh, yep, I definitely see a spawner in there. Because one just spawned in there. Let's put down a torch. Up, oh, wonderful, some more. Ah, oh, sick, he hit me, that's what I like. And get you, let's get you, let's get you. Let's get you before you get me. Put down another torch, another torch. Break these with a sword because we don't want to fall into them. Cobwebs, instant health, and more redstone. Don't really know what I'm meant to do with the redstone, but let's go and break this chest. No, I shouldn't be breaking it with the sword, but come on, we we could get diamonds. We're, we're not that uh rough in our positioning. Right, so we do have, hmm, we don't have a lot of health, and this area out here seems quite dangerous from all the mobs. Yep, it's quite dangerous. Whoa, yep, mm-hmm, keeping it going, keeping the danger real. Got rid of a mob spawner, though, don't know what that would have been, but, you know, it probably helped us that it's gone now. There we go, oh, it definitely helped us that it's gone. Alright, so, is this the... Why is this lit up? I swear I've fully been here before. Yet. Oh, God. Oh, we're gonna die. We're gonna die real bad. I'm gonna go back into our little cave. Maybe. I'm gonna break... Oh, God. I'm gonna break that. And, oh, my God. That creeper is sneaking up on me as well as a zombie. I think I'm pretty good at clutching it sometimes, guys. I must say. Like, I go all right, don't I? Oh, I'm not happy with being in that little teeny hole, though. Right. Oh, God. that's what he said. That's what she... I, I, don't, I don't know why he would say that. But that, that was a bit immature of a joke. And as well as extremely mature of a joke at the same time. Alright, so health time again. Okay, guys. So round 56 million of coming out here. Let's go light up this area. Then I... 
You know, like usually in an episode I'll achieve something. This episode I feel like I've just got dawdled, but you know, nothing amazing has been achieved. So we have been here. I just don't think I live- Oh god, as if I just let- Spiders pounce on you. It's a great, like, I like it. It's- It's really cool that the game does that. Let's- I swear there's a spawner in here. Yeah, there is! I kept seeing sp uh, poison spiders around here, and I swear they were popping out around here, so... That was good. Good call. Good call on the Brenty. There's so many levels to this thing, and... Alright, so... There's... Oh god. Don't really know what- I think I'm gonna go- Oh god. <laughs> I nearly just ran right off that edge. You guys would've laughed. Oh, there's where that staircase was. It was our escape staircase. I remember now, because we actually bumped in- Oh god. Uh, bumped into another area during the process of making it that was also dangerous. It was, uh, at the top. Oh! 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 Don't know where you were. Oh, alright. There you are. So, that sucked. That was, um, nothing really special in here yet that we've found. We've been down here. This is that end part that, uh, goes all the way down to some, like, little farm. Uh, oh! Was it? Oh wow, I didn't actually know we traveled so far to get to the little farm area. That was our escape staircase. And then farm is... I hear a spitter. The farm is here. And that is about it, I suppose, for the uh, mineshaft. So I want to get some comments. Do you guys think I fully cleared it? Or do I have to go and look through every single little pathway just to be super sure? Uh, thank you all so much for watching this episode. Sorry we didn't really knock off an achievement. That's what, usually what I set myself to do. Uh, if you do, feel free to subscribe and don't forget to leave a like and a comment. Bye guys!